Hey guys, uh, I will show you how to make a chord memory device in Reason with uh, like half hacking. And you need the program Loop Meteor or anything similar like Virtual Media program. And the first thing we'll do is create a a new like a virtual MIDI channel, and we call it Chord Memory. We press plus and then we start reason. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the reason I'm making this video is because a lot of people like seem to want a chord memory device. And we go into preferences and control control surfaces. Here we can delete this. And we press add other MIDI keyboard no controls. And we choose chord memory and we can name it chord memory. And we press OK. Close it. Create the combinator. Create uh, depending on how, how many notes or like uh, voices you want. Then we I can let's make a minor chord. Three, seven. I don't know. Chassis. And then we create. We can create anything, but I will create a piano. And yeah, it's very important that that you don't press your MIDI keyboard when you have this marked uh, because then you get a, a MIDI loop so the, and it will crash the MIDI uh, virtual MIDI cable program so the thing we'll do we will lock the radical piano to the chord memory and now we're supposed to have uh, a hmm. Oh yeah, we also have to set these to send to chord memory. Yeah, and there you go, there you have your chord memory device. In reason, and it's it's pretty easy to set up. I mean, it's not it's not that complicated. It doesn't take that much time. And I'm going to try to develop this so you can tune it with these rotaries. So if you want a major or minor, if you want a seven or something, uh, <clears throat> but that will probably. I will do it sometime in the future, but hopefully you will like this video and don't forget to subscribe and like and thumbs up. Thank you